Hey guys, and welcome back to Tome Time Tea. This is your host, C.T. Russell, here with Twin. Hi! And my twin is also my animator, for anyone that's interested in knowing <laughs> that random fact. Anyways, we found a charger! Yay! So we're back in business. And clearly, we're gonna say that this was a suicide. Yeah, those claw marks are obviously self-inflicted. They're not even claw marks. <laughs> but yeah, I would I would say he he did not want to make any noise. What are, what is your problem with conven with conjunctions? Conjun I, I don't I don't know. This guy is clearly they're either trying to make this guy seem stupid or they're trying to make all the other answers as dumb as possible so you'll pick the right one. So that you just feel like you have choices. Well, Reza also clearly lost his gun, so... Can I please go with you didn't want to make any noise? Fine. If you want to do the wrong answer! He did not want to make any noise. After all, he ran away from Maverick, trying to hide from the police. Something as loud as a gunshot would have easily given away his position and alerted others in the area. Right, that could be a good reason. By the way, which wound do you think was the lethal one? I'll go with the one on the neck. Yeah, biology lessons have shown me the one on the neck. Though I am also wondering why there's blood on here. Did he bit the assailant? Maybe. The one on his wings? <laughs> Those look so lethal. There's so much blood coming from them. I think it was the one on his neck. That's right. If all the blood from it wasn't a giveaway, this is a stab wound characterized by a rather small footprint. You can tell it's also the deepest one. Yeah. Wait, there's a footprint in it? And from the location. It's pretty obvious this must have done some tremendous damage. Yeah. What else do you see? Well, there's a lot of blood. Blood spatter suggests he had AIDS. They have dragon AIDS? <laughs> this isn't a lot of blood? This isn't blood? He died here, right? Because it looks like all the blood just pulled beneath him. Yeah. And you can't see any drag marks. No, it they... means he committed suicide. <laughs> My god. <laughs> yes, he died here. He died here, else there would have been a trail we could have followed. The splatters also suggest there was a fight they fought. That's true. Unfortunately, it doesn't help with determining who the perpetrator is. Are you- OBJECTION! <laughs> this is the wrong game! Wrong- wrong game and wrong, uh, place? You do that in a court, dumbass. How could you use that language? Excuse me? Sorry, I- I just always want to say that. Go on, please. What about the blood on his muzzle? Thank you. Yeah, I already pointed that out. You tell me. <laughs> He's a vampire! Yes! <laughs> vampire dragons! <laughs> I need that to be a thing now. I need, need vampire dragons to be a thing. Write a book about it. Or I, we can I make will. a game on it. I We should. <laughs> he bit his tongue during the fight. He has gum disease. He had a bloody steak earlier. Oh my god. Yeah, I like how terrible all of these are. Like I said, they made all the other choices as terrible as possible. This isn't really choice. This is... Well, you have the choice of playing for real or playing like a, like a dumbass. Yeah. 
It might be for the perpetrator's blood. Yes, that is true. I expect forensics has already took a sample of it. So it might actually help us determine who the perpetrator is. Hmm. I think that's about everything. Investigation over. Objection! You know, kid, I'm impressed. Maybe we should have you around more often. <laughs> He's impressed because all the other options. What would he have were known options? What would he have said if, like, we had said it was suicide the whole time? And we didn't put a timer on this again. Yeah, I'm watching the clock. Okay. I noticed that too. But, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Maybe he wouldn't have wanted us around and we wouldn't have gotten such a happy looking dragon. I mean, look at that. It's such a cute little face. Yeah. He's so happy. He's like a little puppy. Oh, my rub his cheeks. System, you did well in your first investigation. Wait, does that mean there's gonna be more? This is a murder mystery. Hey, Chief. twin. <laughs> hey, Chief. Do you still need the witness for anything? Sebastian approached with the dragon who had discovered the body earlier. Oh, it is Adeline from the cafe. She was so sweet. I, I wonder feel if it's bad like that her... she had to see that. I wonder if that was like her sibling or something too, because it looked a lot like her. Yeah. I don't think so. Take her to the department. Get her statement written up, and that should be it. Sure thing. Oh. All right, miss. We're going to have to take you to the department. Who was, who was she? I don't know. Of course! <laughs> when she spotted me, however, her composure brightened visibly. Oh, it's the human! <laughs> oh my god. Those are all terrible choices. Why? Why are all the choices sounding so mean to her? Definitely don't do go away. I, gu I guess, well, I'm a human. But I feel like that could also be really mean. Yeah, I don't... Uh, which one's the nicer sounding? I think, well, I'm human. Oh, uh, yay, she's blushing. Well, I'd call you by your name, but you never actually told me. It's Groot. What are you doing? even doing here? Do you work for the police now? <laughs> it's just a hobby. Yeah. It's like psych. <laughs> just living out the psych dream with dragons. Uh, should I go for it? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> oh, you. By the way, I didn't know you also did deliveries. I do a little of ev little bit of everything, really. That's nice. I love my scrambled eggs yesterday. If you like it so much, why don't you take our number? We could deliver something to you next time if you don't want to come in. Thanks. Mm. Sorry, I guess we should get going. Bye! What do we do now? I suppose we'll head off too, unless... Oh no. What is it? Yeah, Maverick. We've got a violent homicide. And of course, nobody from the department tells me. So I have to find, a, find out from a neighbor who wanted to ask me about it. Good thing rumors travel fast, eh? Get some rest, dude. You've just been shot. It's like major in human world. Maybe it's not in dragon world? Of course nobody told you. 
You're on sick leave. Mandatory sick leave, might I add. I'm not here in any official capacity. You see, I'm merely enjoying a creative walk in the fresh air and happened to come across you by accident. That is literally contradictory to what you literally just said. What do you want? I don't want anything. I want to find, I just find it interesting that no one tells me about this, but the prime suspect's buddy can mess with the investigation. I see how it is. I know what you're thinking. But don't jump to conclusions here. I don't jump to conclusions. I think that the dead body we found says it all. I mean, yeah, there's a dead body. You really have an attitude problem, you know? If you weren't on sick leave, you'd be suspended right now for attacking Groot yesterday. Do you even have any idea what kind of repercussions this could have on us all? Me attack Groot? As far as I can see, I'm the only one who's injured here. Besides, I'm so sorry for apparently being the only one doing his damn job. Yeah, yeah his voice totally would crack in that situation. <laughs> That's just my brilliant voice acting. Yeah. <laughs> right. Let's just all sit idly by while the suspect's on the loose and planning his next move. Yeah. You know, whatever it was Reza was talking about, he was going to tell me just before you showed up yesterday. I don't need to hear you, of all people, belittling me about this. Well, if you had just waited, like, Five more minutes, we would have gotten the plan. What's your problem? If anything, I want to find him just as much as you do. Don't compare yourself to me. Your words mean nothing. Enough. You shouldn't even be here. You better go on now and get some rest. I have disciplinary action. Before I have to take disciplinary action. Yeah. Fine, but when we find him, you'll see I was right. If I have to prove it myself, so be it. Yeah, I got a feeling he ain't going back to bed. What do you mean? Can he even just do his own investigation like that? Well, as long as he doesn't interfere with us, we really can't stop him from doing things on his own free will. On the spring time. And will. <laughs> I see. I suspect he won't adhere to the standards of performing an unbiased investigation, though. He's already made up his mind. It's clear to me he won't be looking for facts, just evidence to support his own view in order to prove it to him, to us or himself. Who knows? It's always been like that. Always something to prove. We'll have to be careful. He'll be looking for Riza real soon. Yeah, I got a feeling he's already gone off to look for him. I might too <laughs> if I was shot. Let's hope we found Riza first. Eh. At least that means someone will find him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if Maverick finds Riza, he'll... Reza will die, but I really don't think I care at this point. Yeah, the only reason why I might care would be if Reza was actually going to warn us of some kind of attack on the dragons, and then we could save them. Mm. I mean, to be fair, I would too if I was shot. <laughs> yeah. I would too. Yeah, that's exactly why he wouldn't be on the case, even if he wasn't on sick leave. Don't worry. Reza will turn up eventually. There's a payphone over there. How do they use a payphone? I don't know. That's exactly what I was wondering. How do hmm. you use a payphone? Is it like the claws? I mean, we just 
talked about how they don't have they like put their tongues to it and just like lip, 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 lip. <laughs> you guys can't see what i'm doing but it's hilarious yep okay lip, so lip, lip, i lip, surely hope so lip, lip. all things considered i had to admit that it reminded Remained a possibility that Maverick was right, but could the res that I know really- You- Why does he keep going back and forth between knowing Riza really well and not knowing him at all? I think this was part of the backstory we kind of skipped. Yeah. But Reza was like his best friend growing up, but then like they grew distant. Yeah. You know what? If you think of something that might help with the investigation, or if you need anything else, just call me. I will. I think we're done here. Let's go. <laughs> so our first led me back home. So there wasn't really much for me to do in the meantime. What should we do? So we can't meet with Bryce? No, we can't. Oh, we can meet with Bryce. Um, Is Anna the, like, the science dragon? I think? You want to meet with Anna? Yeah. Was I Anna? I don't remember. I feel remember. like I was Anna. There's the bathroom sign that uses a human-looking woman again. So much sense. Told me to meet her here, so she's got to be around here somewhere. Product facility had many different wings, covering everything from research to processing, in addition to products. So it's easy to get lost. Motion in the distance, and I. Approached. I was surprised not to see Anna, but Remy as well. Oh, just Anna. Oh, they're they're in a heated discussion. Oh no. Oh yeah, that guy. I oh, remember him. Oh, I forgot. What do you... Did I do Remy? I have no idea. I don't remember. You want me to do Remy, and then you can do. Sure. Um, what, what voice should? Uh, nerd. Um, I have heard the, we have heard the rumors. So you come to me on the basis of rumors? Is that how you operate? What do you want from, with me? This is not the first time you've been in trouble, you know. They might not be so lenient towards you this time. I don't know what you're talking about. Consider this a warning. You should proceed carefully, for your own good. If you wanted to threaten me, the least you could have done was send someone more intimidating. You may be larger than I am, but even I can see that you're just a big coward. You wouldn't dare put a, your dirty claws on me. Okay. Oh, he's red. Woo! I wouldn't. I'm here as a courtesy. Not to threaten or intimidate. Do with that information whatever you wish. And on that blushing dragon, we should probably... Call it an episode. I'm now wondering if this was a terrible idea because I feel like she's going to die now. But you'll have to see that in the next episode. Thanks, guys. I'll see you later. Bye.